Okay, guys, sorry. Um, it's raining where I am. So I think there's, um, there's a bad connection right now at this moment. But can you guys um, hear me a little bit better? A little bit. Yes, we understand. Okay, okay. I'm very sorry for the inconvenience there. We were having some technical difficulties. Um, but I think I have um, the majority of you. Okay, well, first of all, let me um, introduce myself. Like I said, my name is Jessica Guerrero. Um, and I will be with you guys uh, for the remainder of um, this course. Um, I wanted to welcome everybody. Um, great, I see, I, see, I see many faces there. Great, good to see you guys. Um, okay, well, um, hopefully uh, we, can, we can meet the majority. I understand there are about 19 students, is that correct? We are, maybe. <laughs> okay. So I see, let me see, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine students. Okay. Nine, nine right now. Yes. Right now we have nine, yes. right? Yes. yes. Okay. All right. So nine students. Um, and so that means that probably about half are uh, missing, but hopefully we'll get them maybe later this week. Okay. Um, so let me tell you a little bit about who I am. Um, like I said, my name is Jessica Guerrero. I, I, I don't know if um, all of you are in the WhatsApp group, but in the WhatsApp group, I um, explained that I'm going to be with you. And um, well, some of the things I can tell you about myself is that I am, um, well, I have been living in El Salvador for, let me see, almost 15 years. And um, I've been, no, sorry, more. I've been living in El Salvador about 16, 17 years. I've been an English teacher for 15 years. Um, so about 15 years ago, or six, no, 16 years ago, I came to El Salvador um, and I, I came on a vacation. I really liked it and I decided to stay. So um, I'm here after uh, many, many years. I didn't expect to stay this long, but here I am. Um, and uh, let me see, I live in San Salvador. I have a son. Um, and uh, let me see what else I can tell you. Some of my hobbies, I love to uh, listen to music. I love um, dancing. Uh, and I love to watch um, series on Netflix. And um, I like, uh, I like to go to the beach. I don't go to the beach very often, but I love the beach. Um, one of my favorite things to do is to, um, it, you know, just sand tan on the beach. I love sun tanning, you know, just taking in the sun. Just I feel really relaxed uh, laying on the sun, uh, in the sand under the sun. Um, so do you have any questions for me? No, yet, teacher. No. <laughs> Welcome and thank you. Well, thank you. Yeah. Are you sure you guys don't want to ask any questions? No. No. Not yet. You're just being a little shy. <laughs> it's the first class. <laughs> it's the first day. Wait for tomorrow. Know. Tomorrow we, we were talking about, um, more or less about us. <laughs> okay, yeah, you're right. The first day, my experience, the first day is always, um, you know, very, very quiet. Um, everybody is like very shy, but then after that, you know, everybody starts completely um, going crazy. And that's good. That's good. Okay. Well, if you guys don't have questions for me, I have questions for you. Okay. 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 So uh, what I want you to do right now is I'd like you to uh, write down a few things for me. Okay. So school quickly, I'd like you to tell me a little bit. I, I want you to write in your notebook, right? I'm sure everybody has a notebook. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Great. All right, first thing I want you to write down is, uh, what name do you like to be called? Um, you know, what, what name do you go by? Uh, is it your first name, your, you know, your middle name? Uh, do you like maybe a nickname or anything like that? Okay, so write down in your notebook um, a name. Okay. okay. All right, second thing I want you to, um, to uh, write down in your notebook are three goals that you have. Three goals. Okay, and they could be any type of goal. 
It can be, um, for example, um, personal goal. It can be a um, professional goal or anything at all, any, any type of goal that you want, that, you, that, that you're really aiming for. And it could be a goal that you're working on at this moment or something that you want to do in the future. Okay, are you guys ready? Are you guys finished? Needs more time. I don't know. We're finished. No? No. Perfect. Okay, great. Next thing I need you to do is write down three of your hobbies. What hobbies do you have? Okay. Okay, ready? Yes. Anybody need more time? No. Okay, perfect. All right. And the last thing I need you to write down is what do you plan to do with English? Like when you're finished, the whole course, the whole diploma and everything. What do you want to do with your with your knowledge? What are, what are your plans? What do you need this oh, yeah. this um this course for? Do you want to travel, for example? Are you planning to get a I don't know a better job, or maybe you're planning to study somewhere else? Yes, go ahead. Um, what your name is? Sorry. Uh, Jesus. But if you okay. want, you call me Carmen too. For me, it's better too. Uh, first, um, I one of my goal is finish this program. Uh, well, uh, second, uh, travel, and the third, buy a car. Excellent. Wonderful, excellent. Just give me a second here. We're going to give everybody enough time to finish off. Uh, anybody need more time? No. No. That's okay. Okay, perfect. Uh -huh. All right, in that case, uh, what we're going to do, okay, so uh, Carmen? Yes. Uh, so if you want, you can start. You can start there. Um, tell us a little bit about um, yourself, your name. Um, tell us a little bit about um, your goals, your hobbies, and what you're gonna do uh, later on with your name. Uh, okay, uh, I'm work at El Salvador University. I am a a, a contour artist. Uh, I like play volleyball. Uh, I like swimming too. Uh, what more? Mm -hmm. uh, I like uh, listening music, and uh, I, I, my my one of one of my goals uh, first is finish this level and learn to, not perfect but very well speak English. That's it. Good. Good. Okay, wonderful. Thank you very much, Carmen. Excellent. Okay. All right. And uh, when you learn English very well, what do you want to do with it? Uh, I speak fluently. I have a, a lot of vocabulary. And I take a, a, a good conversation with, with other persons. 
Okay, good. Do you plan to like travel to another country and work with um, or talk to native speakers? Well, I, I, I would like to travel. I, I want to travel to New York again. And I, I try to learn more because I need to, to talk with other persons. Okay, wonderful. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus uh, would, would it be Jesus del Carmen? Is that, is that your full name? Yes. Ah, okay. Okay, got it. <laughs> All right, great. Thank you, Carmen. No, I, was just, but, I, I was putting but, two but, and two together. Yeah, yeah but it's yeah, good. I, okay. I, I love it, but um, the person called me only Jesus or, or Carmen. For me, it's, it's okay. Okay, great. No problem. Excellent. All right. Thank you, um, Carmen. All right. Um, who would be next? Any other volunteers? Me, Roxy. Okay, wonderful. Uh, Go ahead. Uh, 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 I, I, okay. Um, I like to call me, oh, oh, my friends and my family call me Roxy. My name is Roxana. Uh, whatever. Any, any, any name, Roxana or Roxy, it's okay. And my goals, I have three ones for this course. First one is to speak fluently or try to, to speak fluently, to know more vocabulary and, and to follow studying and learning uh, a lot or, or, or different topics in English, of course. My hobbies, I like to read uh, different books. I like to watch ser series of in Netflix, especially, and, and to share with my friends and speak with them. I like to to spend time with them. Um, why I I'm studying English or or what my expectation about this course is. Uh, to use it in my work. I I, I work in at Universidad Tecnológica uh, in the international department with scholarship, helping students to, to get scholarship. So uh, it's, it's important to me, um, or for me to speak English because we have different, or we work with different projects with different countries. And sometimes it's, it's very difficult to communicate with them in, uh, my my main or, or my goal for this is to be understandable <laughs> or that understand when they speak with me and I speak with them or to share information and uh, read reading the information uh, of the project we, we sign different agreement with them just that Okay, great. Thanks, Roxy. Appreciate that. Okay, thanks so much. Thank uh, who will be next? <laughs> Any great, great people. people here? Me, teacher. All right, excellent. Go ahead. Good evening. I am Veronica Soto. You can call me Veronica or, or Vero, don't matter. And my goals are to improve my English, uh, found uh, another opportunity, another liberal opportunity, and uh, go, uh, uh, go abroad to a uh, foreign country. My hobbies, I like dancing, I like watching romantic movies, and listening romantic music. And in the end, in the end of this course, I, I want to learn a lot of English because I want to work in a foreign company and visit a foreign country. Because mm -hmm. I, I like a lot of the foreign languages. And only that. Okay, so you want to go to a foreign country? Yes, foreign country. Ah, okay. What country do you want to go to? 
Right. I would like to visit Canada. Okay, good. Any part in Canada specifically that you'd like to go to? Mm, Quebec or Montreal. Okay, I have never been to, uh, to Quebec City or Montreal, but they say especially Montreal is very beautiful. So I recommend I think, it. I think that. Good. All right. Thanks, Veronica. Okay, who's next? Good evening. Good evening. My name is Selena. I am an industrial engineer. I have two daughters. Um, the goals for me in this year are first, be healthy, keep my job, and have more time with my family. Uh, it's important to finish this module because I'm, I am working for a international uh, enterprise, Inchcape. Uh, it's a filial of UK company. And I love traveling with my family, reading and sleeping when it's possible. Nice to meet you, teacher. Thanks, Selena. Nice to meet you. Um, I have a question for you. Okay. Uh, you said that you you work for a, a, a foreign country. Sorry, a foreign um, company. Yes. What what comp uh, Where where is it located? It's located uh, around the world in uh, thirty four uh, countries. Uh, the El Salvador is the last acquisition. The name is Inchke El Salvador. Okay, and where are the headquarters? In U United Kingdom, in London. Interesting. Okay, very good. Excellent. And yes, I have a, I have a gran reto. Because I I don't speak English very well. Oh, it's okay, but this is this is where you are going to be learning, right? The idea here is to help you. So you know, don't worry. You know, if you uh, you don't have to be perfect. You don't. You know, just relax and you know, just try to have fun and um, ask me any questions that you you have, so I can help you to improving your fluency, your pronunciation, whatever you need. So don't worry. We're Thank you very you. much. Thank you. Good. You're welcome. Um, okay, uh, anybody, who's next? Me. Okay, wonderful, go ahead. Mm -hmm. uh, hi, uh, nice to meet you all. Uh, and teacher. My name is Leila Trabanino. I'm, I'm 30 years old. I work in human resources in Figo. Um, I live with my dad and with my two brothers and two sisters. Um, I think that's all. Uh, my, one of my goals is speak English fluently and uh, my plan for my English is get a, a better job in another country. I like my job now, but <laughs> you know. Yeah, well, there's always know. room for improvement, right? <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> yes. That's true. Okay. Well, thank you very much, uh, Leila, for sharing that. Uh, how long have you been in Tio? Uh, two years. Okay, great. Excellent. Very good. Okay, thanks. Thanks, Leila. All right, who is next? Hey, teacher. Hi, everyone. Uh, I'm Gracia Rivera. Uh, I like to be called Grace, um, but you can see that Gracia Rivera is the name that appears in the screen. And 
I'm currently working at World Vision, which is an NGO um, that um, that helps to the to the most vulnerable uh, children and and young people. Um, as the name says, um, it is an international um, organization, humanitarian organization, mm -hmm. and I've been working there for about four years in supply chain. Um, and with this pandemic, <laughs> I have seen uh, that it's very important to work together, collaborating with other countries to get uh, more effective um, negotiations and products, <laughs> as, as you could see. For example, the, the mask and, and other uh, important uh, health, health products that um, went out, out of stock. So uh, as we need to work together with, with other um, uh, partners, um, I think that is uh, one of my goals um, to improve my English. I would like to be um, to become a better um, listener and a fluently speaker, um, and not only with uh, people from El Salvador or Central, Amer Central American people, but from other countries, because it's very hard to understand, for example, the Chinese people. So uh, it's a challenge um, for me. Um, and, what about my hobbies? I like uh, also to watch TV. I think that <laughs> that is because we are uh, uh, last days uh, a lot of time into our houses, home. And uh, I'm here uh, to learn also from your teacher and from all of you uh, here. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you, Grace. Um, I like the fact that you acknowledge that there are different accents and um, each accent is different. And something that is very important that we understand is that everybody has an accent, okay? Everybody. Um, there is no right or wrong accent. It's just there are accents that are a little bit stronger than others, but everybody has an accent. And it's okay to, um, to have your own accent Right, um, but it's also very important um, to know that uh, other people will will um, speak differently and um, and and try to to make your your hearing adjust so that you can understand what different people are saying. So that's very good, Grace. Thank you. Thank you for bringing that up. Okay, excellent. All right. Um, let's see who's next. Me? Hi. Go ahead. Thank you. Good evening, everybody. Uh, my name is Sylvia. Uh, you call me Sylvia. Yes. Okay. Uh, I work in a, a college, a pre mm -hmm, uh, education. I am in administration. I don't teach. I don't. I am not teacher. <laughs> Uh, but I learned uh, many things with that profession because I work in that in institution. Uh, my goal is uh, to um, speak English very fluently and improve, uh, uh, improve my words, my uh, vocabulary. I want to, to know more and I want to speak more uh, naturally um, in that uh, idiom. And I want to share with you and learn so much in this uh, course. Thank you. Thanks, Sylvia. Excellent. Okay, very good. Um, that's great. You have great goals. Um, absolutely. Well, here we are to help you. Anything you need, just remember, you don't have to feel um, shy that or you know that you're a question that you have um, people are going to laugh at it no 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 we're all learning from each other I learn from you too I mean I, I always tell my students that I don't know everything I, I, I try to help you guys but I don't know everything so I will also learn from you so that's excellent thank you very much so so you like the um, Sylvia right 
that's that's the the name you'd like to go by yes yes okay yes. wonderful thank you sylvia okay who's next Me, teacher, Barbara. Okay, go ahead, Barbara. Um, I like to be named just Barbara. I'm uh, 36 years old. I work for Tigo as a telecommunications engineer. And I, I love taking photo, 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 uh, taking photo. photos. <laughs> Uh, photography. Photography. I love preparing cafes and I enjoy reading. And between my goals, uh, first of all, I want to establish my first cafe and uh, I want to finish my master degree. And um, to speak more fluently <laughs> English. Okay, excellent, thanks. Um, question, what is your master's? In business uh, management, business management. <laughs> okay, sounds interesting, great, thank you. And you'd like to be called Barbara? Just Barbara, yes. Okay. All right, great, thank you. I'm asking because some, some people like, for example, they go by Barb or Barbie. <laughs> yes, <Yeah. laughs> so, a friend of mine. Okay, well, <laughs> okay <little> thanks. <laughs> okay, who's next? Daniel. Okay, go ahead, Daniel. Oh, the audio is strange. Hello. <laughs> Hi. Can you, can you hear me? Yeah. yeah, we can hear you. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, my name is Daniel Aquino. You call me Daniel. And um, I work in telecommunications. And so I've been in Tigo since 2000, maybe. 2000, yes. And I have two hours. And, and I like to play soccer. And I like to watch soccer. All of them soccer. I like too much. This is me. So you play soccer? Yes, I like a lot play soccer. And um, how, like, do, have you ever played soccer uh, professionally or on a team? Uh, just at Nintendo soccer. <laughs> yes, no, just Papi. We call Papi football. Yes. Uh -huh. That's good. That's very nice. Excellent. Okay, very good. Okay, guys. Um, do I am I missing anybody else? Yeah, I do. Yes. Right, I'm missing a few people. Yeah, I miss. Yeah. Okay, uh, Jose, is that it? Yes. <laughs> okay, go ahead, Jose. Okay. Yes. Nice to meet you, teacher. My name is Jose Rodriguez, and you can call me Jose. And I I like like to play soccer like uh, Daniels and watch TV and go to hiking and one of them my next goal is speak English fluently and maybe the next year I would like to start a, a master degree in financial financial and my plan with the English is uh, to be ready for some company and, 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 and get a new job. That's it. What kind of job would you like to have? Uh, uh, maybe 
something related about financial accounting or a manager i don't know okay sounds like a good plan okay very good okay excellent thank you jose uh do we have anybody else yes i think we have two more right i think i haven't heard dahlia and i think that's it right Ani dahlia yeah i think dahlia are you there yes hello Good evening. My name is Dalia Lopez. Can you hear me well? Perfect. We can hear you perfectly. Okay. Okay. Uh, I work as an accountant. Um, I, I love to dance. I, I was uh, in academy uh, before the quarantine. Um, I I would like to uh, speak uh, English uh, fluency uh, for uh, talking with another people, uh, in especially native native English, uh, without problem. That's all. Okay, you want to work, you want to talk uh, fluently with a native speaker? Yes. Okay, sounds good. That's a good plan. Excellent. Thank you, Dahlia. You're okay, welcome. I just noticed also that uh, I haven't heard Cecilia. Cecilia, are you there? Yeah, me your, your microphone, Cecilia. Okay, okay. Sorry. Sorry. Good evening, uh, everybody. Uh, you can call me Ceci. Sorry, Cecilia. Um, we can't hear you. I think, well, at least I can't hear you very well. Can you speak a little bit louder or maybe the microphone a little bit closer? Okay. Uh, okay. Just, okay. <laughs> okay. Perfect. Uh, good evening. Good evening, everybody. My name is Cecilia Mendez. You can, you can call me um, Ceci, only Ceci. Um, I work in the, uni the Technology University. Um, my goals, um, well, I have uh, two sons. Uh, my goal is to improve my English, um, I, to speak English fluently. I need to speak English fluently. Uh, my hobby is um, I, like, I like to dance, um, I listen to romantic music, um, and the rest. <laughs> <laughs> and the rest and the and different things about of my family about uh, my songs and the about my job that's all okay thank you very much Cecilia or Ceci right okay thank you all right um who am I missing I I, I don't know am I missing anybody Anybody hiding in the background? No? Okay, all right, great. Okay, guys, uh, this, uh, today's meeting was basically one, I wanted to get to meet you, okay? I wanted to see, um, I wanted to be able to see your faces, uh, be able to put faces with, with uh, names and so on. Also, I wanted to let you know some things about uh, this module. Uh, normally, we go, we go from Monday to Thursday. But this week, we're starting Tuesday. So we're going to start only for this week. We're going to go Tuesday to Friday. Okay, so we're gonna have Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and fr Friday, four days. Okay, so that we have exactly four days of class every week. Uh -huh. okay. Next Friday, 
no class, okay? For, for the other week, it will only go from Monday to Thursday. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay, so I want everybody to clear, be clear about that. So this Friday, we will have class, mm -hmm. but only this Friday. Mm -hmm. The following weeks, we're gonna go again from Monday to Thursday, okay? okay. Um, now, you guys uh, probably already know this, that uh, we, we, are, we have basically 16 hours of classes and the rest we're gonna be working in the platform. Everybody has access to the platform? Yes. Yes. Yes, everybody? Yes. Anybody have any problems with the platform? No. No, no. Trying to solve the exercises. Okay, good, excellent. All right, our first thing that we're going to go on the agenda, actually I was, I was helping to um, start working a little bit on that uh, today, but because of the technical difficulties that we had, uh, which I, I do apologize for, um, we weren't able to get down to that. But what I do want you to do, um, I, one thing I want to do is explore before, in the last few minutes we have, I want to be able to um, get you to answer two questions for me, okay? And the questions I'm actually going to write down, this is not, not something I'm going, we're going to be uh, discussing today. This is going to be something that we're going to be discussing next class. So um, I'm going to write down in the whiteboard, the two questions, well, there's actually more than one question. There's already more than two questions. Um, can everybody see this? Um, no, you did. No? Okay. Can you see the whiteboard? Yes. Yes. Okay, great. So, first question. I'm in primitive. Can everybody see those questions? Yes. Yeah? Yeah. Yes. Okay, perfect. Um, has everybody written written down the questions? Yes. Okay, perfect. I'm going to stop sharing. Okay, so like I said, um, those questions I want us to be able to discuss tomorrow when we come back. So. What I need you to do for homework tonight is try to um, make a little bit of a, a brainstorm. Maybe if you want, you can investigate online and try to find out what are the answers to those questions. Once you understand, once we understand the answers to those questions, we'll be able to understand this topic a little bit better. Okay. All right. Any questions at this moment? No, no. Thank you. Everything is clear. Okay, all right. Uh, one more thing I wanted to let you guys know um, is that uh, if you guys have any questions, any doubts, um, uh, if you're working in the platform 
and at some point you don't um, understand something, you want to ask a question, remember that the WhatsApp group is precisely for that, to help give you support, right, in the moments that we're not in the class. So don't, like, don't hesitate to um, type in the group a question that you have. I will try to answer as soon as possible. I may not answer immediately, but I will try to answer as soon as I can. Okay? Okay. All right. So um, is there anything that you guys, any comments, suggestions, um, uh, doubts that you have? No? No. Okay. no. Okay, then in that case, what we're going to do, we're going to uh, be stopping the class um, and we're going to end today with the class. And um, tomorrow we're going to start right on topic, okay? So we're going to start helping you guys with all of those gerunds and infinite, which is the first part of the, of, of the platform. Um, and oh, one more thing, one more suggestion I want to give you. When you're working in the platform, if, you, if a question comes up, and if you don't want to write it, write it in the in the WhatsApp chat uh, right away. What you can do is write down the question in your notebook so that when we have class tomorrow, then you can ask it. Right. So that's the idea. Always um, don't, because if you if you just remember, uh, think, oh yeah, I have this question, then you're gonna forget it quickly. So write it down in your notebook so that tomorrow, or whenever it is, um, you can come to class and and ask me, teacher, I have this question. Okay. Sounds good. Okay. Right. Okay, teacher, okay. thank you. Okay. You're welcome. All okay, right, guys, you. see you tomorrow. Have a wonderful evening. Bye, teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you teacher. Bye. Bye. Gracias. You're welcome.